hey guys so welcome back to w favorite manager and in today's video i'm gonna show you how to control your submit venue from uh with recapture okay in this video i'm gonna show you how you can control the recapture validation on your submit venue from with one simple checkbox so let's get right into it uh for firstly we have to go to the settings section of w favorite manager we're gonna switch to the google recapture so tab and over here you will be able to see like that we have enabled google recapture global wide we have configured the recapture type with version 2 and we have the uh, version 2 uh, variant of the recapture api key or site key that we are using over here all right so let's get right into it and we're gonna show you how to control your uh, submit venue from uh, with recapture so for that let's open the venue submission from in the front end side so let's go ahead and open the page right over here and when the page loads you will be able to see like the recapture validation is being listed over here okay so same drill uh you put in your venue details let's say test test and if i go ahead and submit this uh venue without validating the robot section uh, it will go ahead and throw an error saying you didn't verify or uh, please verify that you are a robot right like like we can see so pretty much standard flow just one extra step what you have to do is click on this uh i am not a robot section it will validate you or maybe it will present you with a challenge that you have to solve normally and then you can go ahead and click on submit so pretty much standard flow like always and for some reason if you decide to not include uh, the recapture validation on your submit venue form that's also possible so this is possible for every form that we have in the website that's uh, recapture compatible you can individually turn their recapture validation off using a single simple checkbox settings so let's go ahead and do that uh, we're gonna go back to settings and we can turn on the submit venue form okay so let's click on save changes and then uh, we can like reload this page and we will be able to see that the capture validation uh, will no longer appear in the form section so again pretty much the straightforward flow that we have here you put down your venue details and then you can go ahead and click on submit to create your venue so that's how easy it is to control the recapture validation for our entire form using just a checkbox if you want to re-enable the uh, recapture validation over there that's pretty simple as well all you have to do is just revert what you did you can like turn this checkbox back on again kill on save changes and that will bring back the recapture validation on your venue submission form so yeah how that's how dynamic it is and how easy it is to control recapture validation across the website uh, we are working on to add recapture validation to other of our form elements like uh, zoom uh, then we have the contact organizer form and then we have the speaker and schedules add-on that recently we introduced and we have moved to a different approach when it comes to ui uh, yeah that also will have recapture add-on integrated within it so that's pretty much concludes this video let me know in the comment if you have any kind of confusion or doubts i'll be sure to clear them out and let me know if you have any queries or any feature requests uh we will be happily take a look into it so until next time i'm Shanath saying goodbye thank you for watching and i'll catch you in the next one